Good morning. Today we are starting the pups off on their very first day of the raw diet. Got me a nice little big chicken leg to chew on. Bone and all. Yeah. Froze it a little bit so I give them one more time to chew on it. Plus cool them down. It's kind of hot out here. Both seem to be enjoying it pretty much so far. <laughs> hey, go get it, girl. Been doing a fair bit of research on this lately before starting it. And, yep. Yeah, I liked what I heard. Now it's time to try and find out for real. See if we get the same results. Start them off with chicken at first, and then. Ease in some other products later on. <laughs> Namira is just going to town on it. She don't care one bit. Freya's still trying to work her way, you know, figure out how to do it properly. No girl over here is just straight savage. She don't care one bit. She didn't eat all of it. Yeah. <laughs> Freya's just gonna lick the thing to death. I know the first thing someone's going to say is, I thought you were supposed to feed them chicken bones. No. Cooked chicken bones are bad. Because when you cook them, it changes the consistency. It makes them splinter more. It can cause you know, bowel obstructions, perforations, blockage. But when they're raw like this, they just kind of mush. So, it's all good. Hear Loki inside. I had to separate him. He would not the nicest. <laughs> so we got him inside doing his own thing so you can hear him whining in the background. seem to really be enjoying it. Trying to get in there. We're about it. Now, aside from being, you know, more nutritious and, you know, 
kibble. It also provides a good jaw workout, which will stop them from chewing up other stuff you don't want them to. They'll get out of that energy from exercise their jaw muscles. And as they chew the bones, it'll stop any, you know, tartar buildup or whatever on their teeth. So you don't have to worry about brushing. It just keeps them naturally healthy. <laughs> Loki's all scratching the door trying to get out here. <laughs> Silly boy. Well, on Mali Mute Nymeria over here, I'm just tearing that up. Both the girls are about 12 weeks now. Freya's got a few extra days on Nymeria. that note, we're going to say have a good day. Goodbye.